Hi everyone, welcome to VLSI Academy. This is lecture 23 on physical design course related to macro placement guidelines. In this video, we shall be understanding about common macro placement issues that occurs during macro placement. So let us start without any delay. Let us say you have a floor plan like this and in this you have total five different macros out of which let us assume that this A macro and this A has a hierarchy and macro name is M1 and this A hierarchy has also macro name M2 and there is another hierarchy in your design that is B hierarchy for which you have macro M1 and then you have B hierarchy for which you have macro M2 and then there is a macro M3. Now the common issues that we are going to discuss is first that you have here the channel spacing let's say this is 10 micron meter and you were given the top level instruction that at least 10 micrometer channel spacing you should have but here due to lack of spacing you were only able to maintain 8 micrometer here and here also 8 micrometer and here you were further less that is 6 micrometer so this kind of channel spacing you were maintaining so what issues you might see because of this is first issue that would obviously going to come is your congestion related issue so congestion will be coming up and that congestion mostly comes around the macro that is first part around the macro means all the macro edges near to that second you will see because of less spacing that you have maintained you will get congestion in your channel spacing so second issue that you see is congestion will come in your channel spacing third common issue that you can still face the congestion in 10 micrometer channel also and that would be probably because of standard cells getting placed and you can see you can say that it is actually clumping so standard cell getting clumped in the channel and that is probably because you did not apply any blockage so you are having congestion because you are having congestion because you are not applying any blockage so placement blockage is missing blockage was not applied in the channel no blockage you should say that no blockage in the channel area because of that you are facing the congestion and the solution to that is you should apply the proper placement blockage it could be hard placement blockage or it could be soft pl placement blockage you should apply a proper placement blockage in your channel based on your design and then the second most common issue that occurs is improper macro placement improper macro placement by improper it is actually a vague term specifically speaking one issue that we can clearly see is there is a possibility that we wanted a uniform macro placement and that is why we had put this in the uh, in the right side but actually it belonged to a hierarchy and a hierarchy is sitting on the leftmost side and because of that this module has got split up so because of module spl splitting is occurring because of your improper ma macro placement so module should not split up and you should modify the macro placement such that your A and all the macros which are inside A should be sitting together for a better quality of macro placement. Hence, the congestion is coming because of detour that is happening over the macros. Here, one very important thing to note that is module splitting sometimes can lead to timing violation and sometimes what happens is you are not facing any congestion but still there are some long running paths which are going over the design like this or maybe in this direction or could be in this direction from a slash m1 to a slash m2 or say a slash m2 to a slash m1 but because of macro placement which is very bad you are facing long running paths over the design but sometimes you might not face congestion so it is possible that you are not facing congestion and you thought we are good to go but later on you found out that there are long running paths and causing a large timing violations and hence macro placement should be modified so not only it causes your congestion but it also causes you timing violation both can occur or one of them can occur that is also possible next very common issue that occurs is your pin placement 
so sometimes what happens is your plane placement was not correct and because of that you are facing congestion or timing violations in the design so let us assume that there are pins on the left which are not supposed to be on the left ideally and you thought of some interface path should be there because of that you had placed it by mistake or maybe uh, a, you have wanted some uh, advantage out of it but that did not happen and the, instead of uh, putting it on this side you uh, you found out issue that this is causing some long running paths in the uh, port side so your pin placement must be checked and ensure that you are not having a bad pin placement so ensure good pin placement this should be maintained otherwise you might face issue later on because of pin placement also that's all for this video we will come up with more concepts in further videos please give your feedback in the comment section thank you